Okay guys, I'm going to go ahead and show you how you can connect your uh, Android phone into your computer so you can transfer over um, data, for example music, pictures, whatever it might be. Uh, if you're connecting your USB cable and it's not picking it up on your computer like that, that's how it should be picking it up, right? Under uh, the computer, it's picking it up as SCH1, can't read that, 1605. And there it is, so you should be able to, so the way I have it right now, I can go ahead and uh, extract information, put information in there however I want to do it. But if your phone's not doing that, that's probably why you're watching this video. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to go ahead and show you how to do that. Now, go to Sorry about that, my phone's freaking out. Come on, all right. Of course, when I'm doing a video is when your phone freaks out. <laughs> Don't you love it when that happens? Anyway, go to apps. Look for settings, select the settings app. All right, each uh, Android is different. Uh, this phone in particular is the, um, let's see what version it is. Android 4.3, so this is the Galaxy, the Galaxy Note 2. Galaxy Note 2, Android 4.3. Yours might be a little bit different, but more or less, this is how you do it. Let's go back. Um, so basically, in the 4.3, you got to go to More. Under More, well, under Settings, you have this uh, menu, Connections, My Device, Accounts, and More. Sometimes it's under My Device which you're going to be looking for here, but what you want to look for is developer options right here. Developer options. Select that. And look for USB debugging. There it is right there. And then click and uh, then hit OK. Mm -hmm. What's weird is I turned it off to purposely uh, have it not work anymore, but it's still working anyway. But may that's how I fixed it. I went to USB debugging and I turn and I hit that. And actually before you can do any of this you got to make sure that developer options is on all right uh, it might be off so when you look at it from here you should be able to turn it on when you go to it so developer options is on right now and make sure you select USB debugging and then you should be able to see it on here there's my phone Here's all the folders. DCIM is where your pictures are at. Uh, music is where your music is at. I have different music here, dance, electro, modern rap, rock, old school rap, all that stuff. And you should be able to see ringtones on here also. Uh, where is it? Ringtones. Pictures. Podcast, ringtones, see, there it is, ringtones. And I have a couple of ringtones on here. Like I have Darth Vader, GTA, pa Pager Techno. So once you have access to this folder, you can pretty much do everything on here. Music, everything you want to do. And uh, that's how you do it. Make sure you go to developer options and uh, make sure debugging, USB debugging is on. And that's how you get your USB to work. Thanks for watching.